everyone, so welcome back. Today I have a really soft glam look for you guys. So it has a nice bit of glitter and a really strong lash. It's really, really simple, very straightforward, really easy step. So if you'd like to see how I created this look, then please keep on watching. doing so I'm gonna start off the shadow called intuition from the carnival palette and we're just really lightly stamping this on the outer corner of the eye just like so so next I'm going to start blending this out with a shadow called brownie from the be perfect ja palette I'm going to start just really lightly tapping off the edges of that dark brown Up, I'm tapping off the brush just to get rid of the excess and I'm going to start using the shadow Dirty Tan to again really lightly diffuse this color just bring it all the way across but we're keeping the front portion of the eye clean because that's where the glitter is gonna go so the last shadow I'm going to use in this mixture of colors is Peach Out again from the Jab palette and I'm just really lightly diffusing this as far as I can in, but still making sure that I'm leaving the inner portion of the eye clean. So I'm taking the shadow called Lux from the Ja palette and I am just really lightly tapping this on to create the first layer of a lovely sparkle look. So I wanna make sure that this look has dimension. Specifically with these type of brownie looks, you wanna make sure that whatever you're adding has enough layers built up to make sure it's really standing out. So before I'm actually gonna apply the glitter, I'm going to use the 77 Inglot Gel Liner. I'm using the 31 T brush again from Inglot. I'm just pressing it down to make sure that it's really nice and flat and I'm going to start pressing this on my eye. So guys, the next step is one of my favorite little tricks that I wanna share with you. So it's the way I apply little glitters. This is the Inglot Body Sparkles in the shade 54. 54. The way that I apply it is actually by spraying my eye with a fixing spray. Three little sprays, lost me fucking brush. The reason also why I do my liner first is if you put on liner after you put on glitter, you're always going to get a bumpier line than putting the glitter on afterwards. Another little hack that I have for making sure that your glitter stays on for the whole night out if you're going out is to use a liquid glitter. So this glitter, for example, is the Urban Decay Heavy Metal Glitter in the shade Midnight Cowboy. And this is just going to make everything pop 100%. It just catches the light a little bit more. So the last step in this look is to add a nice bright inner corner. The more that you brighten the inner corner portion of your eye, the more it's going to enhance the actual cat eye effect. So I always find that that is a very good tip. So guys, and now the top is done. What we're gonna move on to is the bottom of the eyes. We're gonna use the exact same shadows that we used at the top, starting with the medium shade on a tiny little brush and just patting it down all the way across the bottom lid. So we're gonna start layering the colors again, making sure that everything is coming up as intensely as possible. Then moving on to a little fluffy brush, I am going to take the shadow Intuition, which is again like a medium dark kind of brown, and I'm mixing those two shades together really, really gently. I don't wanna bring this down too low because we don't wanna make it look too grungy. This is almost more like a sultry looking eye. So the last shadow I'm adding is the shadow Basic from the Carnival palette, and just really lightly warming it up underneath a little bit so it's not as, as dark and as intense. So that is what it's looking like now.
tutorial. I really hope you enjoyed it. It was really simple, it was really straightforward, but it's super effective. I would probably wear this makeup look for nights out every single time if I could. I have nowhere to go at the moment, so... <laughs> That's fantastic. Anyways, if you've got any comments or any feedback, please let me know. I'd love to hear you guys' opinion on this look. Thank you so much for watching. I really hope you enjoyed today's videos, and I'll see you very soon. Bye! Where? 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 You really the effect on the cat eye effect. The <laughs> wow. Of course, it wouldn't be me if I didn't burp on camera, would it? Would it be a PCD Diva tutorial? No, it wouldn't.